stop my memes and and ladies uh, how are you how you been I know it's been a while um, I don't know like three weeks or something since the last vid uh, I kind of been doing shit because I'm I'm lazy as hell but anyway anyway I'm back here again and I got a I got a little review for you I got this idea and uh, I figured I'd review it so I went and saw a film the other day and um, what film is it you might say what film is it well I'm holding a batarang and just so you know um, I've got a picture so I'm gonna put it up and then you'll 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 know what it is I, you know it's pretty good let's ah, let's do it let's I'll I'll pin it here with the back oh shit I I just I just killed Han Solo. Oh well. Anyway, let's pin it up. Ow! Fuck. Okay, it's not it's not staying up with the batarang. Ah, let's 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 we'll try with a pair of scissors. Let's let's see if that keeps it up. Uh, there we there we go. That's up. Uh, but for now, anyway, I'm kind of in the way. Anyway, if you can't see what that is, let me grab this and zoom in a bit for you. Oh, little FaceTime. Yep, it's the Lego Batman movie. I went and saw that the other day. Let's just sit that just there. I went and saw that the other day, and I figured I'll review it for you. Because I, uh, I got the idea from one of my friends. He said, why don't you just review it? I was like... Yeah, I might as well might as well do that. So anyway, what to say about the Lego Batman movie? Well, first off, it's kind of a spin-off of the Lego movie. And if you haven't seen the Lego movie, I'd recommend you go see it because it's pretty funny. It's pretty entertaining. And uh, yeah, it's a good time all around. Good time all around, especially if you like Lego. The Lego Batman movie. Um, oh, oh, I've been a pretty excited for this. Didn't expect to be as good as it was, but it was pretty good. Pretty funny. Uh, had some fun heartwarming family bits in between, uh, which was very nice uh, to see, uh, you know. And uh, yeah, it's a, just a good old time all around. So I'd I'd recommend going to see it, uh, you know. And the, the characters, I uh, assume I should talk about them, probably. Is uh, you know, there's Batman, obviously. Uh, you know, he's. He's Batman, uh, you know, he's everything, and if you don't realise, it's a Lego movie, uh, it's kind of like a comedy, it's, it's kind of, it kind of takes the piss out of uh, most of the other Batman stuff, you know, uh, but it's really funny, because it's done in a pretty good way, because it's uh, all the stuff that Batman's done, like, you know, in Batman v Superman, uh, in the Dark Knight trilogy, um, in, you know, the uh, old Batman films, even the classic Adam West TV show. It's all stuff that the Lego Batman has done, which I think is pretty cool, and it's pretty funny, because there's, there's this bit, it's in the trailer, where uh, where Alfred's like, you know, I've seen you go through similar stuff like this, Batman, before, you know, in uh, 2015, 2012 and stuff, 2008, or whenever the fuck, Dark Knight came out, I can't remember, and, uh, you know, 18, 18, 18, 89, no, 1989, you know, with the, uh, the classic Batman film, uh, and then, you know, in the 60s with Adam West, it's pretty fun, but, uh, yeah, so Batman's Batman, he's, you know, dark, uh, brooding, he thinks he's better than everybody, which, quite frankly, I like to think Batman is, because he's the best, because he's Batman. But, you know, so, and he also thinks like that, and, uh, you know, he's reluctant, he doesn't want a family, but then, you know, he ends up, through shenanigans, he uh, adopts uh, Dick Grayson, who obviously is the first Robin, and hashtag Nightwing. Uh, but, you know, so he adopts him through some shenanigans, uh, and he finds the Batcave and stuff, Batman takes him under his wing, and, you know, through the film, Batman kind of reluctant to begin with and but then he he, he sees his value and whatnot and stuff and uh the the joker man in this it's obviously you know every good batman film the joker 
is, you know, probably going to be the main bad guy. The Dark Knight, the Joker, you know. Um, even 89 Batman is pretty good. And uh, But anyway, the Joker's the main bad guy. He's pretty funny. He's he's pretty, he's pretty, you know, I mean, all he wants to do, more, more or less, is to show that he's the best Batman villain. And Batman being Batman, you know, he can't show... That he that he feels anything for anyone. So when it's in the trailer as well, when you know the Joker's like, "I'm your best villain, aren't I, Batman?" And Batman's like, "Well, no, Superman is." And then the Joker's like, "Superman, he's a good guy." And then Batman's like, "Well, I don't have a villain. I'm 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 fighting around or something like that. Like his relationship. It's pretty funny. And uh, you know, in the end, you obviously can." know what happens I won't spoil it but you can just guess that you know what happens what Batman says to the Joker and blah 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 but anyway he's he's probably he's pretty funny you know some of the stuff he does there's a bit where uh, he he's I don't know he's on the Batmobile or something and he's and uh, he's stolen the Batmobile or something from Batman and he's rubbing his butt his little Lego butt all over it and he's saying hey oh, you should call this the Batmobile it's pretty funny. I like I like little fun memes like that. And then there's just the crap load of references to literally every single Batman thing you can possibly think of. It's like, you know, like I said, there's Dark Knight stuff in there. Uh, Bane was one of my favourite characters in there. Because Bane, he, just, he sounds practically exactly the same as Tom Hardy did in The Dark Knight Rises. Like, you know, all in the... The fun posh voice, but it's it's hilarious because he's just doing stupid shit, and uh, you know so that was pretty funny. That there's you know other stuff like um, Two Face in it. You see Two Face briefly, and I'm not a hundred percent sure, but it sounded a lot like Billy D. Williams. And if you don't know, he's uh, Lando Calrissian, and uh, he also played Harvey Dent in the '89 Batman. Um, you know. And it sounded a lot like him, and you know the the Two Face he was in it looked like it would be his character if he had uh, become Two Face, which I think that would have been cool if he become Two Face. That would have been bad ass. I would have loved it, but it didn't happen. We got Batman Forever, but never mind. Uh, but yeah, so the Two Face is pretty cool, and then there's just other little references that I love. Like at one point, Alfred puts on a Batman costume, and it's the uh, Adam West Batman costume, which I, I like quite a lot, you know, being that he's the old man and stuff, and he does pretend to be Batman from time to time. It makes sense he would have the... <laughs> I want to say the t most terrible Batman costume, but I kind of love that costume. But there you go. And uh, anyway, and um, the best one, though, the best reference that I loved is definitely... Um, there's this bit... Where the Joker says, ah, oh, Batman, it's right near the beginning, the Joker says, ah, oh, Batman, come on, man, get nuts with me. And then the Batman, or then Batman, says, ah, oh, you want to get nuts? Fine, we'll get nuts. And then he presses this thing on the back, uh, mobile computer, and it's for, uh, this little thing that just says, let's get nuts. And he presses it, and then all hell goes down. Which I love because in the 89 Batman, one of my favourite bits is the bit where Michael Keaton, as Bruce Wayne, is telling the story to, um, to the Joker. And uh, it's just this normal story about, so I can't remember what it is, but halfway through the story he grabs like, uh, like this umbrella or something, smashes a vase and goes, Now come on, you want to get nuts? Oh no, it's not, oh wait, what is it? He smashes the vase and he and he and he goes. Um, now you want to get nuts? Come on, let's get nuts. And you know the joke is just standing like, what the, f what the hell? Okay. And then he, sh I don't know. I can't remember what happens. I think he shoots or something. I don't know. But he's got a bulletproof thing on, so he doesn't die, obviously. But um, yeah, so that's in it. I love it. It's great. But yeah, no. So Lego Batman movie. I'd highly recommend going to see it. It's a pretty fun, radical time. Uh, you know, it's 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 got a lot of references. So if you like fun Batman references, uh, you know you'll enjoy it. Uh, if you if you if you like to, you know, if you love Batman, but you you kind of like when they take the piss out of the the terrible Batman stuff, like you know, 
uh, the Batman and Robin stuff and stuff like that. It's got stuff like that. It's really funny like that, as I've mentioned. Uh, you know, a lot of fun stuff in there. You'd enjoy it. I'd I'd give it a a a. I guess I should make a review system. I'll give it a a eight out of an yeah an, a, a a ten out of eight a ten out of eight happiness points. I that's I'm gonna make that a thing. Ten out of eight happiness points is what it gets. Ten out of eight. So that's pretty good uh, on the happiness chart. And uh, yeah, so I'd I'd recommend going to see it. I loved it personally. And uh, but yeah, that'll be the review for now. That's a fucking long video, but hey ho. I uh, hope you memes enjoy it. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. I've I've got another Walking Dead review coming, even though you know the last one that I did, which was that no one seemed to like it that much. People probably won't watch this or like this either because the videos are kind of garbage. But anyway, just a quick side note. I'm glad that held up as long as it did because it's just a pair of scissors. And I didn't think it would hold up. But it did. The whole video. I thought it was going to be a fun little sketch meme and fall down halfway. It didn't, which I'm glad about. So on that note, I'm going to let you memes go. And I'll see you in the next video. I love you. Happiness man. Out. Bye memes. Oh fuck, I dropped.